Hello everyone and welcome back to Elden Ring. Today we are going to finally ride the Grand Lift of Rolled. That's what we're going to be doing in today's episode. Of course, last time we went back and defeated the Crucible Knights duo that we found and died to horribly a few episodes ago. We finally got a revenge on them and we also fought a Blackblade Kindred similar to the one that is in Kaled, but quite a bit easier. Still haven't defeated that one in Kaled. Anyways, let's go up that lift, guys. Thank you so much for watching and enjoy the video. Grand lift of rolled. Let's hoist. Let's rock and rolled. I can't wait to see. The sky looks clearer, maybe. It's a bit brighter. I still can't see shit, can I? All right, I'm excited. Let's go. Well, let's get our map. Mountain tops of the giants. We made it. <gasps> Hello, cute little spirit deer. Right, cool. So it actually doesn't look like there's much back here to explore. Maybe we missed some items or whatnot, but it doesn't look like there's a whole lot. Since I don't think we can even travel to this area over here. Cool. Ooh, look at the trees, so pretty. Oh, it's so magical. It reminds me of the area around the, uh, the three sisters, Ronnie's Rise and all those places. Finally. We meet. Who are you? The tarnished. The would be lord. Oh my. Why the long face? I fear that you were previously acquainted with this vessel. Well, that is most unfortunate. Wait, who? For he is dead. As for his flesh, he gave Shabriri? it to Shabriri? Shabriri. I hope you can make your peace with that. I missed most of this guy's quest line. Oh, darn it. Well, shoot. You were about to sacrifice something precious. The life of a fair maiden. That you would toss into the fiery forge. Only so that you may be lord. What a horrible thing to ponder. Your ascendancy requires her sacrifice whether she wishes it or not but how would the lord crown so he looked upon chosen tarnished and would be lord 
dare to tread the path of true rigor, spare the poor girl, and singe your own flesh in her stead. If you are prepared to show resolve, and attain lordship through righteous hardship, then heave the words of I, Shabriri. But I thought, wait. Chosen tarnish, descend and seek all. If you inherit, then the girl. Was oh, that new dialogue? Can be spared. Shit, I thought it was Setting repeat. You on the righteous path of lordship. I the don't path even. Of the lord of chaos. Burn the earth tree. Sorry. Thought he was repeating already. And incinerate all that divides and distinguishes. Ah, oh, may chaos take the world. May chaos take the world. Even the animals are getting into it. Chosen tarnish, descend into the depths. Far so descend into the, the depths. Capital. Seek audience with the three fingers and the, the flame three of fingers. Frenzy. We're gonna meet the five fingers, the four fingers, the one finger. Um, okay, so Shabriri is the is an NPC that we didn't do his quest line and then he died. Or the guy who took over the body is named Shabriri. Or does it matter since I didn't even do I don't even know who any of these people are. <laughs> he used to be called Yura. Oh, okay. So Yura died and Shabriri is now in Yura's body. Wait, Shabriri sounds familiar, but I don't remember. Anyways. Shabriri's grapes. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's where I've heard Shabriri before. Okay. So we've never met Shabriri, but we have heard the name. Because of the grapes. Uh, so arcane increases bleed buildup, not damage. That's fixed at 15% of max HP. Increases, well, I mean, that's good too. Yeah, that's good. We got to get that bleed proc, right? There is something I'd like to say. My purpose was given to me by my mother, but now I act of my own volition. I have set my heart upon the world that I would have, regardless of my mother's designs. I won't allow anyone to speak ill of that. Not even you. I don't say anything. I ain't say a damn thing, girl. go up here Ooh, okay so there's another map we can figure out how to get over here um oh a very narrow thing to cross over a river wonder if it's iced over or not we have a telescope we have a erd tree okay minor erd tree Yes. Let's go forward, I guess. We want to go north. Okay, let's go up here, I guess. This is south, though. Guess we gotta go around. at this bird <gasps> why are you attacking me you're so pretty and i don't want to hurt you oh my god they're gorgeous <gasps> it's so beautiful but 
You have to die. I'm sorry. You're you're a pretty chicken, but <laughs> I can't be having that. Their coloring is so pretty. Oh my god. I really, really, I really like birds. Birds are so cool. They have so many beautiful, like, they're just so varied and and cool. Okay, there's the lift. That's where he came from. Other colorations and all that kind of stuff. I don't like hurting birds, but sometimes I have to do what I have to do. Tees Treasures. Swimming Snow Miners bell, bell bearing. Oh, that's right. I was going to go and turn in the bells when we were in uh, the bell bearings. When we were in uh, at the round table and I forgot. Okay, this is maybe bad for me. Yep, this is bad. I'm dead. I'm trapped and I'm dead. That was very not cool. Well, it was bound to happen that we would finally die. Because Bondo sent me this video, and it's of a fish that is completely trans... Errant? Translucent? It's, like, clear. I don't know if you guys will be able to see it at all. <laughs> well, you can kind of see. You can kind of see the outline of the fish. I didn't know any something like that existed, did you? That's crazy. wonder what that thing is called. I have to look look into that. I love discovering new animals. Like animals are just cool. Like fish, birds. There's so many cool shit out there. And I'm always like seeing pictures or videos of animals that I had no idea existed. And they look so crazy. They look like mythical creatures sometimes, and it's like, no, that's just some thing that's like in Australia. Like, damn, what the hell? <laughs> Animals are cool when they're not in a FromSoft game. Yeah. I mean, the animals in the FromSoft games look definitely very awesome, but also they're all trying to murder you, so. Oh, you know what I have equipped, actually? Fire pots. I wonder if that would be good against these guys. Oh, no, it didn't do shit. I thought maybe fire would be useful. Um. Wow, these guys are super tough. Did I hit the, 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 the what you call it? The difficulty spike? Because this feels insane. These are just normal enemies. I mean, I know we fought the boss, the Zamor guy in the, um, you know, he was a field boss and whatnot in the Everjail a long time ago, but. God damn. Okay, let's try. It's like I want to fight them one at a time. Even then, it seems very difficult and it's difficult to fight more than one. We should probably call forth our skelly bros, I think. Um. That might help us out. Did my 
Holly Rose die already? One of them's there. We killed one! God, oh, God! Oh, this is so annoying. This ice breath shit is bullcrap. damage that they do to me compared to the amount of damage that I do to them feels very imbalanced and they're so aggressive and they, they keep jumping away from me whenever I'm about to hit them ah! <laughs> um, I guess we have enough now should we level them or should we level something else I haven't really explored any of the summons, really. Greeting, are you here for spirit? Let's see what we have. Redon soldier? Oh, two Redon soldiers. Well, I am wearing Redon's Stuff. I, all of these have different like strengths, right? Like they do like something special, but I, I wouldn't even know what. They wi wield fiery weapons. Yippee! I feel like I should get the Radon soldiers because I'm wearing the Radon helmet still. I'm like, I've taken over Radon's army. Grave Glovewort. Oh, so Grave Glovewort is like... Um... I can't hear. I suppose the Dung Eater must have left the round table. I just pray nothing ill comes of this. <sighs> yeah, I kind of set him free. Grave Glovewort. I thought he needed Ghost Glovewort. Anyways, let's get these guys. Screw it. I probably have tons of this Grave Glovewort stuff. We could probably level up a few of, like a couple of them, maybe. Oh, wait, wait. Oh, these are the ones that use the ghost. Oh, okay. Night Maiden and Swordstress Puppets. Red Maid Knight Oga Lutel the Headless. Mimic Tear. 
Stormhawk Dean. Latena the Albinoric. Oh. I want to level her up too. That sounds fun. Need more money. I need so many freaking runes to this shit. Sorry, guys. I'm just going to use a shit ton of runes here. Because I keep having to go back and use them. It. Okay, well, I got her to plus seven. We can get our Skelly Bros to plus six. And then we got the Radon Soldiers to plus six. Were they up here? Oh, here's my... Yeah, here are my runes. My zero runes. Okay, so now we have... Latena... Since we have a quest that she's kind of involved in, I thought it would be cool to summon her. I don't know if she's any good, what she does, but let's do it. Okay. Does she do ice damage? I feel like that's not very useful against these guys. It looks like she does ice damage. Maybe I should have used the other summons that we upgraded. I think they have fire. I don't know if that would do any better. Oh god! She's about to die. I can't let her die. She's helping me. I want to tr uh, try something here though. But one of them's almost dead. Oh, what? Where am I? I probably have something that can help me negate the ice damage. But it's too late for that now. Magic damage, negation, lightning, holy damage. Nothing for ice? I mean, I, stuff, I have stuff that might help with that a little bit, but nothing specifically for ice. Not cool. Not cool. Can I not summon her again because she died or because I don't have enough FP? Probably because I, I don't have enough FP now, right? There's one. Is there... Are there more? I only want to fight one at a time if I can help it. I guess I'm just going to go ahead and test this. Oh, I only have ten of these? Okay, I can summon her again if I have the FP. Wait, 
Or can I? What? No. Ooh. Okay, you know they're not so bad if they're not double teaming the crap out of you. So I can't summon her again. Is is she dead? Is that why? Yeah, but it's not necessarily frostbite buildup that I want to decrease. It's more of just like the damage of the ice itself. Maybe magic damage negation is what I'm wanting. But there is like fire damage negation, so... I was hoping there would be something for ice damage negation. Maybe I didn't get the recipe for it. You know? Maybe a talisman? Oh, right, right. Well, we got past the two. So I think, I hope the worst of it is over. Right, we want to be super, super duper careful. I can't summon them either. How oh, come? Am I not- I'm, I'm not in an area where I can summon them anymore, is that why? We'll just gotta be awesome on our own. You can only do one summon per area without resting. Ah, that's what it is. Okay, see, I don't know the rules of summoning because I've barely used it in this game. I always thought I couldn't resummon because I didn't have enough FP and I just left it at that, you know? Okay. Oh no, the other one did see me. Well, this is gonna be a long and strenuous battle. many of these damn guys. I better get like five levels up after I clear this area. No, no. Guys, I don't know what to do. This is fucking ridiculous. Is this whole giant place going to be like this? Am I in hell? Has hell frozen over and I am here? You're here in frozen hell. Like, it takes so long to defeat them because you have to just... Every time you try to get in there to do some real damage, you just get punished by the fucking ice breath. Okay. Look. 
But we're doing it. We're doing it. We're doing it. Look, we're getting good. Okay, okay, okay. There's more. Let's get him. I hope to never have to come back here ever again. Some more ice storm. Ooh, nice. Okay, I think he's the last guy up here. No backstab? My, my angle was kind of off there. Stop trying to backstab. It's not going to happen. It's not happening. Where did this guy come from? He just jumped out into this fucking sky. So frustrating! Frustrating enemies! FromSoft is so good at making the most frustrating fucking enemies in the world! And this? No, no, no! No! I am fucking gonna throw my controller! Fighting them in these ruin ruins sucks. I'm, I'm, I'm literally raging right now. I keep getting in corners. Fuck the what? my hook claws would have been better because they can just attack faster because so many times like my attack is just so slow with these i don't know i want to go home i never want to i i don't want to be here the the elden throne can suck my fucking dick okay the elden ring can go into like the fires of mordor i don't give a shit this place is hell. These enemies are the worst. That was the most frustrating thing I've ever done in my life. <laughs> okay, no, we're fine. We're great. We're awesome. Let me get in here. Oh, I've already been down here. Is that all there is really in these rooms? I saw one more item somewhere. Probably no big deal if we don't grab it. Maybe I was imagining things. Okay, I'm leaving. 
I hope there's nothing else in there because, um, I never want to do that again. Oh, here, this is probably what I was. Yeah, this looks like it. Hold on, hold on, hold up, hold up, hold up. Cured meat. Cool. Okay, where am I? All right, let's go back to our grace. Sucks because they really just need like four or five hits. Yeah, but it's so hard to get that fucking hit. Castle, is it time for more Hollow Knight? That would probably be easier than what I'm doing right now. All right, so how do we get up here? We need to be up there. Is there like a a thingy that we can jump up the wind? Nima bobber, you know what I'm talking about? What's it called? All right, we're going to go a little bit faster here. Let's get on our horse. We got to find the good stuff that this area has to offer. Like more really annoying enemies. Are these people oh he's got a big spiky whip Really cool. Oh no, he's gonna kill me! I'm just kidding. I like enemies with this kind of design. It's like an executioner type thing. Ooh, that blood loss. That blood loss though. Ooh, let's use our claws. Let's do some claw stuff. You guys bleed? Show me how you bleed. I'll die before the bleed damage proc, though. So. Look at him just dangling there. He's so cute. I don't really need that, and I'm not going to I'm not going to die trying to get it. So we're just going to go. He's so cute. OK, I'm super excited to go across this very narrow path with um, death below me. Look at this view. Look at that. Is that like a giant chain? I'm gonna take it slow. We'll go on foot. Make sure we don't fall though. I wouldn't put it past them to put a gap in this thing that you can't see until you're already falling down, you know? I am very glad that there are no enemies up here. Lost Ashes of War. We 
we are going to some kind of castle, maybe, looks like. Oh no! Oh my god, no, 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 no. That will knock me right the fuck off. Oh, never mind. I thought I had to use the horse to jump up there, maybe. Golden rune, good, I need those because I used all mine. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Rainbow stones. Okay. <laughs> okay, it's really hard to dodge. Oh my god. It flies so fast. I don't feel really comfortable fighting him. It's close to the edge. Time is it <gasps> okay we have an hour and a half left guys let's see how far we can get oh we found a grace beautiful No level up. This place is very serene. I see a big boy up there. Should we go say hi? Does he have any friends lurking about? first real quick. He doesn't bleed. I wonder if I should switch weapons.
just tanky. You would think he'd get knocked over by now. How many times I've hit him. There he goes. Can we get the attack? Okay. So we have a map here. We have a map here. I think we want to get this map, probably. So let's go this way. Yeah, this way first. We have an assassination target that we have to assassinate. Let me get these little fuckers. Oh, big fucker. Oh my god. I love these claws so much. I need to get them to plus 25. I need it. Hello? Oh. Sweet. Sweet. It just feels so good to murder things with these claws. Okay, bats. Bats need to die ASAP. Do not let them fly, whatever you do. Oh, this is gonna be so annoying. Hey, let me summon my, um, she can shoot them. What is going on over here? What is all this noise? There's someone up there. I guess she's just gonna... Thank you. Yeah, shoot over here. Ignore whatever that is for a second. Shoot ha! She kind of squishy. Oh, here's the guy. Hold on, let me, let me take these guys out. Who are you guys fighting? Oh, it's the bats versus the monkeys. really trying to shoot that enemy that she cannot reach from her vantage point, isn't she? All right, well. We have to assassinate someone in here. Invade Juno Hoslow, Knight of Blood's world. Yes. We will do that. Oh, he looks like he's straight out of Bloodborne. Uh oh. He looks like he might be a little bit trickier compared to the other uh, invasions that we've done. That whip is a little bit crazy. He's got two whips, actually. Heal. 
Heal, 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 heal! <laughs> I don't have enough range to fight this guy. He's too slippery. There we go. Got him. That was tough. That was tough with the claws. But we did it. I used all my heals, but we did it. We got a rune arc. Beautiful. Lovely. Love it. Love it. Ooh, we got whip and uh, armor and oh. 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 Let's check it out. We have some whips, right? Where are the whips at? Oh, we we have a whip. We have Hoslow's pedal whip. The skill it has is kick, so you'd have to probably get it something else. Um, although, I mean, kicking to break a, a foe's stance can be really good against probably shielded enemies and stuff. Metal whip formed of razor sharp chain link blades that have the appearance of flower petals. This work of art is handed down through the generations of the illustrious House Hoslo. High dexterity is required to wield this weapon, but it excels at inflicting devastating blood loss. The house, the tale of House Hoslo is told in blood. I mean, I guess this seems cool. But it, does it not have any, like, combos, or...? It just seems like it's... Oh, I guess it does, but it just seems kind of broken because of... It's not, like, fluid, like if you would use, like, a sword or something. Because you have to, like, bring it back to, like, crack the whip again. Try double hand. Oh, okay, yeah, let's do that. Does it, uh, does it do damage twice? It looks like it might, like, when it goes forward and then when it comes back. Pink. Oh, we have our flasks back. I guess the flasks... Oh, I wanted to check out his armor. It looked cool. Look at this helmet. Whoa. Look at that cape. Look at that cape. Look at those horns. Let's rock this for a while. Seems fun. Merchant man. Is someone there? A customer? Well. Probably a long freaking time. Alright, let's buy these. Alleviates buildup of frost. Ah. I mean, yeah, that's kind of cool. Um. Missionary cookbook. buy those. Where are we now? Up here. Okay, hold on. Oh, 
Oh man. So much to explore. So much. Okay, I think we need to go back around this way. Let's just get maps. I just want to get maps. Maybe we could get both the maps. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Clouds! Look, you can kind of see. It's like cleared up a bit. Wow, it's like we're in the sky. Guess we're really high up in the mountains, huh? We're like above the clouds. That is so cool. Ooh. I like it. Me likey. <gasps> Eating sushi. What kind of sushi? Stargazer's Ruins. I like sushi that has something refreshing in it. And or spicy. Like, I love cucumber. And, like, herbs and stuff. They're herbs? Or, like, green onions? I don't know. what The stuff that they put that's, like... Gives it a little bit more of a flavorful... Profile. <laughs> huh? Who's that? Who's there? Waifu? Waifu? See the stars? Held shut by a seal. <gasps> How do I? Is the jellyfish talking? Or is she down here? Is she in there? How do we break the seal? I kind of want to kill the jellyfish to see if that... See if it'll open the seal, but at the same time, I'm wondering if the jellyfish is the voice that I'm hearing. Okay, so I want to do as much content in this game as possible. But I don't want to uh, spend a lot of time trying to figure things out. I know that's part of the fun. But is there anything I can do right now with this? Like to open the seal or something? You guys can tell me. If you want. I have a jellyfish summon. <gasps> I do have a jellyfish summon. I do want to know how to break the seal. Hi, Adagio, by the way. Okay, so... It seems so obvious. When you think about it. Aww, how cute! I feel like I'm setting Butterfree free. <gasps> Bye, Butterfree! I cry every time. I got a fancy spin. Oh, I cannot see shit. So, I still have the jellyfish summon. It'd be cool if it was just, like, gone. Gone forever. Primal Glintstone Blade. Okay, cool. My summon has a name. Yeah, jellyfish. Duh. <laughs> jellyfish. Spirit jellyfish ashes. Oriella. Or Aurelia, sorry. Ash remains in which spirits yet dwell. A floating spirit that illuminates its surroundings prone to tears. The jellyfish girl searches for her distant home. Will bravely spew poison at foes on her summoner's behalf. It seems her name is Aurelia. Lovely. Thank you for your hope on that, guys. Hey, Salkin. What's up? Salkin Tay. That's why the summon side appeared to the... Oh, I didn't even notice. I did not even notice. This is the most wholesome part of the game. I'm surprised there's anything wholesome in this, wholesome in this game at all. 
Well, I hope I hope they get to see their stars and I hope they enjoy enjoy that very much. We have about an hour left. So let's see what we can do. And I think next week we'll just play this all week. start a new game other than Elden Ring quite yet. You're supposed to be dead! Okay, those guys do a lot more damage than I was expecting. I, I almost died there. I greatly underestimated them and their strength. Here lie Aurelia and Aureliette, who never saw the stars. What happened to Wholesome? So, did their physical forms die, and then that was their that was like their spirit forms, right? And then they finally went to see the stars, right? Right? Tell me that they went to see the stars in death. They got to they got to see their stars. Okay. God damn. 